everybody, it's Amanda from the St. Louis Science Center's Science Off Center team with another experiment for you to try at home. But before we get to our experiment today, I just want to say hi to all of the students in the English club at school number eight in Nova Kakovka, Ukraine. We're very excited to be sciencing with you every week. So let's play. We are going to experiment with surface tension. And you're going to need some very simple ingredients for this. I have some water. A bowl. I like to use a nice big container, but you can do it in a small container like this if you really want. I have some breakfast cereal, some paper clips, and for later, we've got some dish soap and the very scientific tool, a pointed stick. A toothpick will work great. So, we're going to play with surface tension. So, what is surface tension? Surface tension happens at the surface where the liquid meets the air. Now inside, you can't see, but this water molecules all inside the bowl, they're all pulling each other in all directions equally. Now the ones on the top though, there's no water molecules above them, so they're kind of being pulled inwards just a little bit by all the water that's underneath them. That creates a nice skin. When we drop Cheerios in, you'll see how they float on top of the water. That's because they're nice and buoyant. But we'll also notice that they start to clump together and drift towards the sides. This is all due to the surface tension. So those Cheerios are going to work on finding each other and getting towards the side. But we can play with surface tension with things like a paper clip. Now paper clips are more dense. And if I try to put it in there, it just sinks. But if we're very careful, I can put a paper clip on the water and have it float. And we'll notice that paper clip is going to behave the same way the Cheerios do while it's floating on top of the water like that. It's going to kind of float around and be attracted to the sides and to the Cheerios and to the other paper clips and all start to clump together all because of surface tension. Now one thing that breaks the surface tension is soap. So if I take my pointy stick and put it in the soap, what's going to happen is those soap molecules are going to disrupt that surface tension. And they kind of push stuff around and oh no, there go my paper clips, kind of fall into the bottom. So have fun experimenting with surface tension and be sure to check back again for more science experiments. See you at the Science Center.